Hey everyone, this is Tony from ODrive, and I have a quick video on how you can sync all of your Google Drive accounts to your desktop. So ODrive allows you to connect as much storage as you want, uh, including as many Google Drive accounts as you want. That's all for free. So a lot of folks tend to want to link more than one of a certain type, and Google Drive seems to be a pretty popular one. So I'm going to go through that real quick. You can see that I have uh, Google Drive already linked here. That's because I use that account to create my ODrive account and it automatically linked the storage. So if I want to add additional Google Drive accounts, I can click on link storage, click on Google Drive, authorize. And this is going to bring up, you're probably going to see the same type of thing. Uh, this is going to list the Google accounts that you've already logged into before. If you don't see the one that you want to link, click on use another account and then log in. Uh, generally, you're probably going to see the one that you want. Uh, I've already linked this one. This is the one I originally linked. So I'm going to use this one now. I'm going to click on it. And I'm going to say allow for this permissions dialog. And now it's linked. And if I go to my desktop client, this would show up automatically uh, after a little bit, but I'm just going to force a refresh so we see it right away. And you can see now I have Google Drive number two here. And you can also rename these if you want. There's a uh, re uh, edit option, which allows you to change the name if you want, just to give it more context, especially if you have lots and lots of, uh, of the same type of storage in here. I'm gonna link another one just to show you that you can keep doing it if you want. This time I'm gonna link this account, click on it, same process. And now that's linked as well. If I go to the desktop client, refresh, there's Google Drive number three. I can click into it, and it has the data that you expect. And that's it. So you can continue to do that as long as you want as, for as many Google Drive accounts as you have. Um, the same applies to every other storage, but Google Drive is, as I said, one of the most commonly requested ones. So I wanted to make this quick video for the folks that are wondering how to do that. I hope it was helpful. And I hope you have a great day. Thanks for watching.